welcome to Picture Book Drama, where it is everything in entertainment. I am your host, Sean, your video and comic guru. Welcome to another mailbox unboxing. I got a bunch of stuff to show you. Um, I got one from, where, from Target and one from the Disney Movie Club. So we're just going to go ahead and jump right in. I got four from Zabby. Zabby, if you guys are not aware of, they have great deals on steel books. You can get them starting at anywhere from like under 10 bucks, and they can go up from there, but they usually always have some sort of deal going on. So that's what these four are. But before I get to them, let me show you the one that I got from uh, the Disney Movie Club, which is The Lion King. This one is the signature edition. This one actually um, comes also with a... Um, what would they call that one a movie frame or film frame sorry kind of what they've done like with Star Wars um, Phantom Menace and a bunch of other ones they'll give you like a um, a small film reel or sell I should say that's really what it is but nice little slip cover so I'm happy about that so this can go up my Pinocchio and Snow White eventually I do want to get all the Disney films but I have so much stuff I got to get that it kind of falls on the back burner but this actually just showed up. I didn't even realize I had, um, I was getting this because being a member, you get the option to opt out of getting the, um, that month's feature. But I guess I didn't know it. But I am very, 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 very happy to have this. This is possibly one of my favorite Disney films. So that's The Lion King. And I am pretty sure I showed you this one. This is from Best Buy. And that is the Wonder Woman Steelbook. This is the Best Buy exclusive. Uh, so far, the only place that has done a steelbook has been Best Buy. The reason why I showed you that one was Target also has an exclusive one that is a digibook with a lenticular cover, which goes well with my Man of Steel and my Batman v Superman and my Dark Knight. <laughs> um, Dark Knight Rises, sorry, uh, digibooks. I didn't get the one for uh, Superman Returns yet. And I don't know if they did one for Man of Steel. If they did, let me know. But that's awesome. And honestly, guys, I ain't, I'm not going to lie to you. As far as what's different, just the covers. That's it. I like the Digibook because you get a little bit more, um, you get more colorful photos and other things like that. And you get the lenticular um, cover. But I do like steel books too. So I went and um, got both. Oh, and speaking of Wonder Woman, fuck you, Amazon. I had pre ordered. The Wonder Woman um, limited edition that comes with the statue. I ordered this a month ago. They uh, sent me an email earlier this week to tell, or last week, and telling me my order's been canceled. Where's my money? You know, I paid 124 bucks for this damn thing, and now they're telling me, oh, we don't have your payment. So I have to go through all this crap with my bank, with them. They're constantly telling me I didn't pay. While well, my bank shows that it did, fuck you very much, Amazon. I'm going to have to, like, if I can't get it somewhere else, I just may not get it. But I know me, I will end up getting it because it goes with everything else. But that was bullshit. <laughs> but let's get to Zabby. Get to something good. Um, how much did I pay? This one was $21.43. So that's giving me an idea of what this is, which is going to be awesome. Oh, yes. But it, oh, this thing here, I hate when, I hate when you hear that. Uh, so... Basically, Universal Pictures is releasing, Universal Studios, I should say, are releasing all of the Universal Monster films on Steelbook with special covers by artist extraordinaire Alex Ross, who is possibly one of the best realistic artists that you're going to get in comics. Um, he's actually been known for, like, Kingdom Come and uh, uh, Marvels, which is where I got it that from or where these two are from because they're designs off of Alex Ross's work but this one is the Wolfman and I had to open it which I didn't want to do because I have so many copies of the Wolfman but I love this cover and I hate it hearing it this move around that just irritates the hell out of me so that's the front that's the, um, the back with the uh, paper on it there is the back of it very cool I just like the fact that it does have the name on it. And whoop, there is the inside of it with the disc. Now that thing don't want to come out <laughs> and without. So it is awesome. And 
they're doing all of them. They're doing Dracula, Frankenstein, The Bride of Frankenstein, The Mummy, Invisible Man, and Creature from the Black Lagoon. So I have that one. So mad I had to open that. I gotta find a, um, a protector for it now. This next one was $24.43, so could be another one of that line. Yes, and the disc isn't moving around. <laughs> uh, the next one I got is Dracula. Love, love, love Alex Ross's work. Now, I'm not going to open the other ones just yet because I don't need to. Uh, so there's that one. Okay, now these two are $11.21. $11.21, so I'm not sure what these are. But I like the fact that it's got paper on it, or plastic. Ah, I was waiting for this one. This is another uh, limited edition steelbook for Spider-Man 3. Slightly lenticular cover. I mean, it goes well with the other Spider-Man uh, ones I have, which are... Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Yes, I keep all my stuff near me. You got Spider-Man. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think that, oh, if this is what I think it is. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Spider-Man 2. So you cannot go wrong with these. These steel books I am very much in love with because they look cool. You know, got nice little lenticular covers with it. So that's Spider-Man 3. Spider-Man 2. And Spider-Man 1. Now they did do Amazing Spider-Man 1 and 2, which right now Zappy doesn't have up, but when they do, I will be snagging those up. So I got those. Let's move all this stuff. So that'd be it for the steel books. Now we got this one from Kieran Hobby. I have been waiting for this for two months. I will uh, give you guys a warning. With Karen Hobby, if you order multiple items that are back or back order or pre-order, you are not going to get your order until all of them show up. You could do it separately, but then they will make you pay uh, separate shipping and handlings, and that can get really, really expensive. <laughs> I don't need that now. At least I hope I don't need it. I love that I packed it super tight, which lets me know. It hasn't gotten damaged. Should I do? Yeah, show you that. <laughs> oh. oh, baby, I've been waiting for these for so long. So long. Okay, well, how do I got to do these? Beautiful um, packaging, though. I mean, they got bubble wrap taped up. Yeah, I love that. So, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. patience. Patience is a virtue, people. It is. But I will say, here in Hobby, you can get stuff super cheap, though. Um, these are both uh, Cotabakia Marvel, Marvel Now pieces. And normally, I will let you know. Actually, I'll just show you. The first one I got, Agent Venom. Oh, so sweet. The side. The back. This shows you the artwork that it's based on, and the two on the bottom are obviously of the statue itself. And you got that one. I just love these covers. I mean, I love the fact that you got the statue up there, but then you have um, artwork in the back. Really looks cool. And then, now this one, I was getting real impatient with because I saw um, that this was out. Agent Venom came out first. Uh, this one... This one took so long, but I am glad, spitting everywhere, I am glad I bought this um, through Kieran Hobby because I saved myself possibly $30 doing so, and that is Carnage. I saw this at rec or at uh, GameStop for $72. I paid forty nine or $48.99, $48.95 actually, yeah. Double check that. Look at my receipt. Yeah, $49.95 for Ford Carnage. $46.95 for Agent Venom. 
this is going for about 50 to 60 bucks, but this is going for about $72. So, here is Carnage, the side showing us uh, his logo, more showing your artwork it's based on, and then here's the back. I mean, this is going to be great, and I am going to be doing a mass or a series of unboxing and reviews of the Spider-Man Code of Ikea um, sets right now because I think right now they're at five. There are two more that's coming out. You got um, the original Venom and you have Spider-Man 2099. Neither of which are out yet. You can pre-order them, but remember if you pre-order both, you're not going to get your order until both pieces are in stock. Two months for this. And these have been out for about a month. So, just an FYI on that, but that means I will have Carnage, Agent Venom, I got the Amazing Spider-Man, uh, Ultimate Spider-Man, Miles Morales, and I have Spider-Gwen. Now, I do have a um, Code of Ikea with, I think it's Bushido, um, uh, Spider-Woman, which was everywhere I looked for that. It was super, super expensive, but luckily I was able to get one at 50 bucks so I will eventually do all of those and the next video I'm going to do is actually going to be a comparison video of Geek Fuel and Loot Crate who is better what should you guys be looking for is it worth the value so definitely keep an eye out for that that's why I haven't put up a, a mass mystery box um, video because after this I'm just going to do them as they come I used to wait for them all to show up and do one big video but if I do them individually, it doesn't take up a lot of your time. You could do them in like less than 10 minutes. And I can go ahead and get more videos out. Win-win. But that's going to do it for me right now. Hit me in that comment section. Hit that like button. Guys, please hit that subscribe button. I need all the help I can get to get as many subscribers out there. I am hitting, I'm everywhere, guys. Hit me up in any of these places right here. You know, if you want, hit that comment section. Facebook and Twitter are the fastest responses from me, but any of these um, sites right here, I am, I will definitely answer you back. That's going to do it. Hopefully you like that. Hopefully you guys got these. Hit up Zavi. Zavi has great deals. Because right after this, I'm definitely going to be ordering the Frankenstein Steelbook. But that's do it. So thank you very much, guys. I am Sean, your video and comment guru. Remember, pitch book drama is everything in entertainment. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.